the second best free throw percentage in the conference. They shoot plenty of them, almost 20 per game. Oh, Richard Caldwell Jr. with a few. Percent from the field. Here's the dribble drive offense. Foul Bowers will lose it. Here's the dribble drive offense. Everyone looking to drive, create, drive, kick. Mills from the corner. Tommy Dengsi calls it in America East action. Sessoms, the lead to Saar. A beauty assist. Worked hard and got back to where they are right now. LJ Owens rattles around, no good. Rebound up ahead for Saar. Leads the field. And George Tinsley. Just a little sped up there by, by Ben Shunku. He made a great move, but just was a little bit rushed on the finish. Still no score. Sessoms being guarded by Ben Shungu. That'll be a matchup to watch. Backdoor bounce pass layup that is good from the big. And can fight and claw back, like you said. Good defense by the Catamounts. Tinsley driving. Good closeout by Lamb. Five to shoot. Sessoms driving. Wraparound pass. Sar layup is good. Coach Gino Ford. Gino Ford. Seawolves have a one point lead, but it's no more as Pierre. A lot of ye out. More time for Stevenson. Moore. He's taking advantage of it. As Pierre Saar takes advantage of a good feed down low. Josh Hopkins. Now the run for New Hampshire over the last nine minutes, 15 seconds is 27 to four. Wildcats got the ball at Guadarrama. Willing pasture. Bearcats came with a double team. Hopkins answered the bell. Off the bench, chase him underneath. Nine for Horvath. We'll mark that one. It's a two-point lead for UMBC. And right back. Struggles continue shooting the ball. Now one of ten. Sessoms for Saar. back out for Sessoms with eight to shoot. Double team comes to Sessoms. He kicks it for Caldwell Jr. in three. That's good. Sessoms feeding Saar. Back to a three-point game. Now credit Sessoms. Position into the box, and he just backs Willis down with an easy little hook shot for two. Three pointer up and in. As Great hands by Sessoms there as he reached around Horvath as he went by and created the steal. Yeah, he really does it all. The three pointer on the wing. That is. Defender easy. closes him out, makes him move off his spot, but he knocks that one down. <laughs> Jackson with the step back, and Tinsley. Less than 12 minutes to go in this one. Oh. oh, beautiful. It's tougher to make that pass. A start the Bearcats could only have dreamed of. 13 point lead, less than four and a half minutes in. Saar, bang! A little head fake that a lot of guys don't use that much anymore, but it's pretty effective. Oh, no one picked up JJ Brown. Trailing by 24 in the first half. George Tinsley, good. By Trump Sessoms. Three. One open fourth. 
three. Short, no. Rebound by Sessoms. And he spins away and ends up with a four on one. Hands it off for Saar, and Saar lays it up and in. Academy. Hard on him in the middle of the zone, so he's just able to shoot right over the top of him. And that's what poses such a problem for defenses. You go up to him, he goes around you. You slack off him, he knocks it down. And just able to score on all three levels. You see, we've seen the mid-range jump shot, the three-point, and then just finishing at the rim, too. Drive by Sessoms and the handoff. For Looks like they're going a little zone here now. Stony Brook, a little 2-3. Sessoms scouted by Latimer in that zone. Brenton Mills knocks down his first three. Level 10, one guy can take the game over, and it couldn't be a different guy every night, certainly. Well, maybe Caldwell can do it for Binghamton. Steve. for the Bearcats. Look to, to be the leader. As just a sophomore, Tinsley, two for two from the, to start the game is Sacred Heart. A Pioneers team that shot 31% against stiff competition their first two games. And you know, remember last year in here, they only shot 30% for the entire game. So much different ball club this time. How about this? Tinsley shakes off one and drills the three. Pioneers can't get a shot. Tinsley straight away gets it. Tie game. In the game, they like him. He scored a lot in high school. 1500 at Amity. Tinsley again from deep. New faces on that Bearcat bench, but those new faces, combined with the limited number of returners, have given Binghamton a three-point lead. Make it a six-point lead. Newcomer Brenton. Three-point shooting. This year they have videotape on him, and he's going to be the focal point of every scouting report moving forward. The reigning America East Rookie of the Year gives it up to Tinsley, and Tinsley under a minute to go here at Levy and Jim. They're going to go flat and let Sessoms go one-on-one. -on -one. They know he's feeling it. This is the exciting matchup. Point guard on point guard. Helmerson for three. Ring it up. The Sessoms three is a Cassius Winston triple. He's turned down the pick and roll. He got Sessoms off balance. Let it fly. Well, it's raining threes all of a sudden. <laughs> oh my goodness. Cassius Winston was mesmerized on the bench. And then... <laughs> At the ball, Guadarrama, willing pastor. Bearcats came with a double team. Hopkins answered the bell.